Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can do all of the achievements within the Temple of the Jade Serpent dungeon, which counts towards the glory of the Pandarian Hero achievement. You can find the dungeon entrance over here in the Jade Forest within Pandaria. I would recommend running this with a character that does low-ish damage at level 110, or removing some gear pieces as bosses will die pretty easily and you don't want them to die immediately, as some of the achievements require the boss to be alive, and some have a tendency to bug. So the very first thing that you want to do is head into the instance, turn right and kill this boss first as they are not important and will only be a pain in the future if you don't. So once you've killed them, head over to Wise Mary and here you will be able to get the first achievement. This one is a little tricky if you are melee but the basis of this achievement is not to stand in any water or get hit by the boss's swirling water ability. I just stood on this edge to avoid the water, but after the first phase of the fight you will be knocked back, so just make sure you aren't going to get knocked into the water by facing your back towards a wall. Now in phase 1 you won't be able to attack the boss, but he will spawn 4 sets of adds. Let these adds come to you and then kill them off, as if you kill them on spawn it has a tendency to bug out. Once you kill all the adds, phase 2 will start and he will begin to cast his swirl ability. All you need to do now is kill the boss off. If you're standing where I currently am, then you won't have to deal with the swirl at all, so you can pretty much one-shot him. After he eventually RP dies, you will gain a buff which lasts for 5 minutes, quickly run through to the next set of trash and kill them off to spawn the next boss. This boss can pretty much just be nuked down, as she has nothing of interest. Now we can move on to the final boss. All that you want to do is carefully lower his health down to around 20% and then stop attacking him and wait until he puts you into a shadow phase. Once in this phase there will be four crystals that you will need to click, two on each side of the room. Once you've clicked all four crystals, kill the shadow image of yourself and then finish the boss. Assuming you have done this before the buff ran out, you will get both achievements from killing this boss. And that's all of the achievements that you can get in this dungeon. I hope it helped you guys out. I will try to get the other dungeons done as fast as I can. Thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.